Hey, welcome to Draft Academy. My name is Mike. In this tutorial, I want to talk to you guys about using JavaScript to write HTML. So one of the cool things about JavaScript is you can actually write valid HTML entirely from your JavaScript and then it'll show up on your HTML pages. So over here I have this script.js file and I also have this index.html file over here. And these two files are wired up, they're connected. So you can see over here I have these script tags inside of the head of my document and they're just linking to that script.js file. So over here in this script.js file, I can actually write HTML that will show up on my HTML page. And you can do that entirely from JavaScript. And we can do that using a command called document. And when we type out document like this, it basically refers to the HTML document um, that this is getting linked to. And then we can say dot and write. And what this will do is it'll basically allow us to write HTML to the document. So inside of these parentheses, whatever I put in here will get written out to the HTML document. So I'm gonna put uh, just two quotation marks and I could just write some text in here so we could just write anything. And now this is actually gonna show up inside of our HTML document. So you can see that it shows up up here uh, on top of all this other stuff. But what's cool about this document.write command is I could write actual HTML inside of here. So if I wanted, I could put like a header two inside here and we can say JavaScript rules and I'll go ahead and end off that H2. So this is a valid line of HTML code, but I'm writing it inside of a JavaScript file and you'll see over here it shows up. So this is a header two. If I was to inspect this element, you'll see down here we have a header two with JavaScript rules inside of it. And really you can write any HTML that you want. So I could write one line here if I wanted, I could make another line and we could put something like a horizontal rule and it'll show up over here. So you could write an entire HTML document just from your JavaScript using these document.write commands. And I wanna show you guys how you can actually control this. So you'll notice here the JavaScript that I'm writing is showing up right on top of this existing HTML. So if we look inside this index.html file, you'll notice that we have a header one down here. We also have this paragraph. And the JavaScript rules and the horizontal rule, those are showing up on top of this stuff. And that's because we put this script tag inside of the head of our document. So you'll notice that the script tag is up here and it's on top of the H1 and the paragraph. If I wanted, I could move this script tag and that will control where this Java or where this HTML that gets generated inside that script tag shows up. So if I wanted, I could put it right here in between this header one and this paragraph, and I'll just paste that right in there. So it's in between them. And now you'll see that this JavaScript rules and the horizontal rule, when I save the file, show up in between. So we have JavaScript tutorial. And this is the code that we generated using the JavaScript and then we have the paragraph down here. And if I wanted, I could put this below both of those elements as well. So now it's gonna be below both of them. So you can control where the JavaScript generated HTML shows up by controlling where you put these script tags. And if, if I wanted, I can do anything from inside of here. So I could even add some styling onto one of these elements. Style is equal to, and whenever you're using uh, HTML inside of these parentheses, you always, inside of these quotation marks, you always wanna make sure you use single quotation marks. And the reason is because if you use like one quotation mark, you see it'll end the actual string. Um, so we, you don't want to do that. What you want to do is use single quotation marks and then we could write whatever styling we want. So we could say like color blue. And now this header two will be colored blue. And we did all of that just from our JavaScript. So this is a really powerful way to use JavaScript. And this is kind of like a good first lesson in JavaScript, which is, you know, that JavaScript and HTML work really well together. Like JavaScript was designed to work with HTML and that's why you can literally write entire HTML documents from inside your JavaScript. So I really wanna drive home that point as we start with this JavaScript course, which is that you know JavaScript is tightly coupled with HTML. So that's the basics of using this document.write command. This is a really powerful command and you're definitely gonna to wanna to practice using it. You know, Practice just putting little HTML tags inside of here and seeing how they display on the document.
Hey, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and subscribe to Draft Academy to be the first to know when we release new content. Also, we're always looking to improve, so if you have any constructive criticism or questions or anything, leave a comment below. Finally, if you're enjoying Draft Academy and you want to help us grow, head over to draftacademy.com forward slash contribute and invest in our future.